Greetings, my friends. This is Gilles Mancillon. I'm calling to coming to say hello, and uh, I'm also called to to make a little announcement before. Not an announcement, but um, it's a call to the community. I'm here to speak about transcendental psychology for those who who are new to the channel. It is uh, something that spirit tells me to trust, but I'm um, like my my presence on this physical plane. To, uh, called me to, to say that uh, I, I wanted to to thank you so very much for like for the, I had this channel for 10 years and for the last three years I've been thrown into a very challenging and difficult time for those who follow me know that and I wanted to thank you for all your donations you, you could have made you made or also the, the the counseling session and the painting I have sold also, also on my left line huh? I'm at the end of this long this three years period of really really intense challenge and yet I found for the first time in this during this three-year period my, my bank account is in the red so if you can make a donation it's like I'm eternally be thankful uh, and, and if, I also have about I don't have my paintings with me I'm hoping to get them back I know I'm gonna have my money very soon I'm gonna get all that together in, in, until then I have about 20 paintings I made in Brussels on paper and I would be willing to sell them for less money, much less money than I would normally, or even uh, get a loan against the painting. I, I could like buy it back twice the price that as soon as I get. Uh, so so it's just I will show those paintings. I thought I, I had to make uh, make this call. Um, maybe, I sh maybe I shouldn't worry, uh, you know, but um, it's it's like uh, sometimes the divine plan is like sometimes it takes longer than we expect and so I have to take protection measure against consequences that might possibly arrive if there is not this point although spirit is saying it's orchestrated you shouldn't worry about it so I thank you so very much huh? and uh, and um, so um, I'm, I'm gonna come to my message of the day I'm sorry if I I just feel I have to make this call because I, I really have to travel right now I don't have a, I don't have any money I can't stay where I am it's like I'm living in one piece of luggage for for three years it's like uh, but everything is going to be solved by from one day to the next so I, I, I know I don't worry about it but um, it is uh, it is up in the air so it's like a cultivating faith, but we will see what happens. So it's very important to stay heart-centered and to, to, to cultivate the sense of unity between prana, between presence and purpose. To have one, this unified field, because what, what's important to, to understand is that the, the material and the, the physical is always in opposition to the, the eternal and the spiritual. And it's like everything is like a mirror in, in many ways, so, so it, which, which actually serves both sides. But it's not always obvious when, when we go through uh, challenging uh, um, experiences. And everybody is right now on the earth. Huh? There is um, there is a lot of spirit, things that spirit shows me about my future that didn't make sense when they showed it, and now it seems to. So so I do have to continue to trust, and there is a line that's a reality that's already been designed for us, and, and sometimes we meet certain circumstances that were already designed. So, uh, but we have to let it come. When we try, when I try to move towards it, it's like it runs away. It's like it, it moves, it moves away. So it's like it's it's it's, it's really um, spirit is saying that I'm going to paint. So it is good news. It's like that's what keeps me uh, sane in this world to be able to create those paintings as well as many things, but friends and such. But um, um, so so it, it's it's like uh, it's just being in in the moment, being in the now, being in the presence, being a, and uh, and a, a awakening universal consciousness, the soul. Uh, uh, and sometimes we need to focus on the goods that we did, on, the, on the, what has been achieved, rather than always be focused on what is not done, huh, what has not been done. So, so it's like it's a balance between the two. It's like understanding the, the everything begins and everything ends right now. There is just the now, so we can make all the beginnings and all the endings. So be it. And just uh, thank you so much to the Creator for bringing this divine uh, energy into alignment. And the card of the day is going in circle. We're going to go in circle as long as we need to, as long as we don't get the, the point. So, so it's like, uh, but in the new new phase, we right now when we say I am, we already have a star in the universe that we do not know. But very soon we'll be conscious of that star. I've seen mine. Uh, and we'll be uh, connected to a constellation of stars. So we won't feel as much alone. And it's like... Um, 
we hold a blueprint of the fifth dimensional uh, galactic paradise reality within us, both on individual and collective for the planet. And so uh, it's about all about personal fulfillment, joy and creativity and abundance. And um, and health and wealth and all that. For for it is a it is. It, we've been through a very very. I don't know how you you've been experiencing that, but I know for the past few months it's been extremely intense and unexpected forms of deep initiations, and I felt some of the tests. I have to admit, but. It's like uh, we have to accept the consequences of, of, of the of the reality that we create, so that we can recreate in a better format. But there are certain things that I know has been has been uh, protected, and um, a lot of people are. See, the galactics when they're gonna come, they're gonna be a first contact. They're gonna be able to show us the ins and outs, or. or uh, how yourself can show the ins and outs. Otherwise, we'll, we'll find out the ins and outs of old things after we, people after they, after they die. So, uh, but but in this time, we have the opportunity to receive the information while we are in the body, as much as is possible, divinely possible. That is, but um, there is a lot that's been we, we're going to be shown. A lot of things that we have done are, are good, and then we we have limitation, and so we. We need to correct our mistakes as much as possible, uh, as fast as possible. Once we know what it is, not I guess. But uh, um, see, see, the, I think the soul, for, from what I see, is that uh, the the soul has a very different agenda. For here, we have the agenda of of fulfilling our desire and and life experiences that we choose but the soul seems to be also interested in that but very much into our, our spiritual ascension into our the, the the perfecting of our character all kinds of things it depends what our soul aspirations are because we're all guided differently and um for me, it's, it's actually right now, it's like whether the first contact or the political change, this is completely irrelevant. The only thing I care about is to have a home, pay this debt, according to the link to the, my father's passing away and this my grandfather inheritance that was hijacked and so on, to to to, uh, to get my painting back, get a home, and uh, all of that will be clear, I'm sure, sooner or later. Um, and so it is very personal what I need. It's very personal right now. What I need is to, yeah, is to, to come into this alignment and tell my point of, of freedom. Um, and I thank God and the angels for making this path as enjoyable, as fun as possible. It is important when we have fun, we don't have time to worry about things. When I was younger, I was having fun all the time. I didn't have any money, but I had a lot of fun. And I, I was in great... I mean, I never had a substantial amount of money, but um, but I had a lot of fun, and, and now it's like um, it's like living in France has been really difficult. In America, everything was fluid. I had more connections there. I mean, it is nice in France. France is like is like a Sleeping Beauty. It's going to awaken. There's so much talent. French can be very essential to the into this golden age as well, as well as America, and many other places. For it is a planetary. Every country has every culture has something to 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 to, to bring to the the global consciousness. The highest wisdom. The, the observer of the day. Sorry, before is is the figure of authority to be an authority. The highest wisdom is the wishes. To know that we've made wishes. So sometimes we made unconscious wishes, so we, 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 can, we can negate that, but sometimes we made wishes for our highest good, so we want to hold on to those. What we need to do is uh, to understand is the scribe of the writer. I'm eager to start painting, but I'm also eager to start writing. I, know, I, could, I could handwrite, but it's, I'm just waiting to put it together. Because it, it's already together, the only what I need to write. Um, what we need to do is Atlantis. Atlantis is to awaken those memory of the fourth, fifth dimension, and the outcome will be to face all our fears, to face, to, to face all our phobies, and 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 once once we become free, then there is this uh, this bride and groom coming. It's like once we overcome all our fear, we we, we are able to attract a, a, a complement, a divine complement, as well as if we need a physical complement, long term relationships with ourselves we have, and so. Um, For the soul wants to teach detachment and from the material thing and, the, and and connection to the spiritual self. So so it, it is it is testing. For me, before I have, I have a lot of carrots before me, like 
a lot of points, a lot of things. It's like, whoa, I'm always very excited to move forward. Uh, yet, uh, the, the, it's like the, the see, because we, we have to learn to, to continue, keep going regardless of the disappointment. And regardless, it's really, um, if we, if we don't want to give meaning and, and sense to our pain because it, it creates suffering and we do not need that. And huh? we just want to find that it's not easy to complete the inner peace, the alignment of all the energies because there's always something coming up and there is always the life is dynamic it changes all the time so but um, it's important to look and feel every thought to see if we want to expand it or if we if we want uh, uh, or if we want to label it or judge it how do we re what's our relationship to a thought is it something we want more of or is it something we want to let go huh? It's much easier to do that after we feel them. A lot of people will refuse to feel that. And we want to, feeling is the, is uh, is more important than thoughts in many ways. And uh, because what we feel, we are able to heal. If we don't feel it, we can heal it. What we feel, we can make it real. It is it is uh, the the aspect of this uh, the, this feeling sense and feeling and emotions are different things. But we feel our emotions, and so um, but it's important to feel our emotion rather than skipping the experience because it can be painful it's like um, every we are learning throughout our life and from the cradle to the grave there is not such a time when we'll know it all <coughs> or we'll, we'll cease to need to to learn something and the more we know the more we advance the faster we'll be angry for knowledge and we'll just we'll, we'll continue to create circumstances that will teach us and so um for many, many of the gifts from the cosmos and, and heaven, that they've been given many, we've been given many, many gifts from heaven, but they haven't been unwrapped. It's like programs that haven't been in, uh, installed yet. So, so it's it's all coming, and it's like uh, continue to to work on self development, on improvement, on asking to 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 um, for this upgrade uh, into the into the the new integrated energy. Um, but shifting the shift of the Earth's polarity that is going to ha happening, that is going to be happening, it's like it already started. It's it's a pretty big deal. It's pretty major, um, and it's not because it's not visible that 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 we're not in the light. Even if there is no clarity, we miss. We, there is still a light that shines in me, like the song say, "Let it be." Uh, you know, is there still a light that shines on me, and within me also? Even if we don't see the inner light shining, it is there. Um, and uh, and it is confronting the the darkness. It's like because the the darkness, the ghosts and the demons and all that. It's like it, it's God allows them to to exist as as a contrast for awakening. So so it is important to know they don't really have power. They don't really exist. Even they're real because we feel them. But as we disconnect from that energy, they lose their their, their function. Their function is only on the lower planes. So we just want to overcome those fears. And uh, well, there's like a ghost that, and shadows that are hunting us, but it's like uh, they're, they're just illusions. And it's like truth is the eternal love of God. <coughs> but because this whole experience, we live it very in a very personal way. Yet the, the storm that is coming is a collective happening, and we have to be aware of that. There's a collective detoxification of the psyche. A lot of old things that will need to be removed, uh, to, to be reborn. I pulled a few cards with the Dakini. And uh, well, stay heart center. Huh? Just uh, we want to defy the obscurity to go to go into fear, to bring love into fear, to bring hope into despair, to bring uh, to bring light into into darkness, to to bring trust, transform doubts into trust. Focus on beauty, compassion, and the unlimited potential that the soul has. Because the, the soul of flesh may be coming. It was a spirit, a great spirit that I, I never never heard discussed through channel or the earth before. It's, it's called Immanuel. Is the is is a supreme Trinity origin being. Is the console of the of the fathers. Father God of our universe, the Paradise Creator Son, is like an older brother, and he was saying that he was he was he was the he was the the, the shift. He was the he was this solar flash that will manifest it as we will 
assist the, the, the energy to the, whatever is dominant within us will be emphasized so, so when, if you have a lot of things negative just go use the violet flame and and know you 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 get you you're getting rid of negative energies but a lot of people are cultivating this fear and domination and power and 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 for that that will augment within them but if we have a lot of love and light then that the solar flash will greatly enhance that so because what is reality reality is all aspect of the mix of the truth and the illusion we believe to be real. Right? It's about the inner perception and the outer perception, the individual and the collective. It's something relative that grows and evolves. And uh, and just uh, but uh, keep hope in your hearts and hold the light uh, in your intention. Yeah. Even if we face constant disappointment, uh, it's like w w without us, the shift would not be possible. The earth would have self-destructed. It's like with all of that we, we, we're traversing is really making this possibility. We have millions of people awakening, the hundreds of thousands of people that have awakened a long time that have been holding this life and they're making the possibility for the shift for the humanity. Otherwise, the negativity will devour everything. So, so it is do not diminish the value of being here, holding the light regardless of what life is showing you as as a mirror um because uh, the, and there are the millions of people that will be awakening will awaken the billions and uh, so it's, it's the way it works for uh, what we give for, for they're going to be moving from third density to fourth density and for us we're very likely moving to fifth density or above all the light workers and the teachers of light for we have to learn and to teach to teach what we've learned well i hope this message was interesting for you i'm going to show you briefly those 20 little paintings i really appreciate if you can assist me i know six things will be in timing but if you have some investing in art or it's like i would or if you want to lend me some money against the the the, the paintings i will definitely buy them back for, for a good price when I when I get start my project, this is those are abstract money. Well, it's not an obligation. I'm just offering that because I think I have to do something. I cannot just stand and and wait for 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 God to intervene in my life. Well, actually, it's like this. So sign. They're signed on most of them in the front. Some of them in the back. I think most of them in the front. Those are all vertical ones. And those are quantum field series. They're called. There is all kinds of little stories in them that that uh, that can be seen uh, with time. It will be much better, nicely framed. Of course, paperwork always suffer when they're not framed. But those are finished. I looked at them long enough. Look like this guy here, this red guy, it's like a Feistos with his hammer. Like, um, this one's more like a snow scene and it feels like a mountain scene. Also, so I strike there is a, fig a few figurative and conceptual ones afterwards. This one I had many offers to buy it on, uh, as NFT, but I've never been able to sell one. It was a lot of waste of time and energy and not so much money because I, were, I didn't really invest in it. but. This one says joy, love, and harmony. Oh, it's like a mirror effect. Those are easels. So most of those, those paintings have gold in them, so at night they will look very, very different. So if you're interested, send me an email huh, if you have any interest. Very soon I'm going to be able to present all of free. I'm going to get all my art back and I'm going to, be able to present it in a very professional fashion. It's going to be so nice. Mm. So like it's a model I started in 1987. I was living in New York. I did those little pastels. They were easels, painting within paintings. They were really nice. I don't know what happens to those the little series. This is a moon child. But I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna take on uh, take on it on a large canvas scale also. This one has a more like spiritual um, symbolic. Uh, those are the godheads. The, the, this is more the physical part of the godhead, and the, the, the spiritual part. 
And uh, yeah, one of those, uh, I have a few of those, but I'm not sure that I finished it with uh, this girl, this model, and this girl that's been popping in my soda eyes for like many years. So I've, I've been I've been painting her. Well, I'm gonna finish with a song. I thank you so much for your time and for for all you do for for the planet. And uh, thank you so much for assisting me, if you can. And um, we we all we we all are really at the at the door of a major breakthrough. It's, it's very sometimes it, it requires a lot. It's like we're really tested as well. So I'm finished with this song. It's a light song. It's something that talks about. Um, it's called Yellow Submarine. In the town where I was born lived a man who sailed the sea and he told us all his life in the land of submarines we all live in a yellow submarine yellow submarine yellow submarine we all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine. So we sailed into the sun till we found the sea of green. And we live beneath the waves in our yellow submarine. We all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine. We all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine. And our friends are all aboard, many more of them live next door. And the band begin to play, to do 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 to do to do 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 we all live in a yellow submarine yellow submarine yellow submarine full steam ahead mr brainston full steam ahead cut the cable drop the cable yes sir hi sir captain captain we all live in a yellow submarine yellow submarine yellow submarine as we live the life of ease, every one of us has all it needs. And the sky, sky of blue and, sky, and sea of green, in our yellow submarine, we all live in a yellow submarine, yellow submarine, yellow submarine. What a community. To live in a yellow submarine. I had this vision that I was in a submarine. But not really, but it was kind of, I don't know, it's mysterious. There's so much under the sea that we do not know. So the most of the space of the earth is going on, on the, under the sea. Most of the activities. Well, there's a lot going on on the surface of the planet as well, of course, with all of humanity. But there are many, many other life forms. And so we, uh, the observer is encountering, meeting uh, some important people are coming to our life. The highest wisdom to understand is protection, to know we're protected uh, we, we, and we're protecting a higher vision. What we need to understand is indulgence and uh, to, to, to find the balance in, in not to be uh, too indulgent, but uh, not to be too severe as well. So what we need to do is humility, to stay humble. And the outcome will be the one, the, the card of the one, the energy, the power, the power of the, the power angel. And we're, I'm going to pull a last card with the. And it is the Lady of Gabriel, mature, practical spirit, generous and happy. Take care of yourself and those you love. Capacity to make everything more beautiful. Practical and wise advice. So, uh, well, personally, I, I do right before I did this video, I received some in, some insight that was interesting about an alignment. So I'm just like, we'll go with the flow. I thank you so much. I wish you a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you later. Namaste, my friend.